Each tattoo starts with a description from the client, and it's my job to translate that into a physical piece of art. It's way easier to do this when I understand the person I'm working with. Now, there are definitely times, you know, where people are flying in or I haven't met them before, and, you know, we do our best to, to work with that and the separation, but the more I tattoo someone, the more we do sessions, get to hang out, talk, really just the easier it is to create that for them. If you're in my chair, yes, any of my clients, like we're having a good time. We're laughing, we're talking shit the whole day. We'll stop, we'll have food breaks. I mean, we're really just getting to hang out, which is the best part of my job. I think the relationship between myself and the client is the most important thing. Don't get me wrong, but when people come in, they want to get a nice tattoo, they want, they want the artwork to be there and have it be solid, but it's really an experience. You know, I'm tattooing seven hour sessions. I'm spending a lot of time with my clients. We're going back and forth, we're chopping it up, you know, all day, and we have a great time. I have a great time. You know, we're laughing, we're playing. These things, will lead to repeat business. I don't know about you, but if I go t get tattooed by someone and they suck, they're not talking to me or it's uncomfortable, no matter how good the artwork is, I'm not coming back. You know, just as much as I want them to be comfortable, I want to be comfortable as well. And I get there through conversation, through learning about this person, like things they like, they don't like. And that's what translates into an amazing tattoo experience. What I'm saying is don't be afraid to talk with your clients. Some of them are actually cool. Maybe not all of them. I've made tons of friends uh, and awesome relationships through my clients. Sometimes I'm more excited that they're coming than they are to come here. Like today I looked at my schedule and I'm like, oh f yeah, Nick's coming, we're gonna have a great day, we're gonna chop it up, we're gonna talk about Alex all day, and it's just gonna be a great time. Early in tattooing, one of the biggest challenges for me was interacting with people. Talking with them during the session, have them looking at my art while I'm doing it. And this was something I really had to practice all the time. And it didn't just have to be in the chair. It could be out of the shop, but like going out of my way to start conversating with people, topics to talk about. Some people it comes really natural too. For me it did not, and it was something I really had to work on. When you do it, you get comfortable with it. It makes the client comfortable. You learn who you're working on, which I think is really important. It can make me more relaxed along with them, and energy is everything during a session. If I'm tense, if they're feeling uncomfortable, it's going to end up translating into the art. That's why I always, always, always during the session, like I'm laughing, I'm joking, we're interacting with other artists in the shop. It's just one big out loud conversation that anyone can join. It includes everyone. You can say something and contribute to the conversation, or you can just sit there and be entertained by all the weird, funny things all the artists are saying. This is the kind of atmosphere that I love to work in. Communication with the client is so important right off the bat. Like even starting with the consultation and the description, we wanna get everything on the table as soon as possible. We don't want people to bring up ideas or say things later in the process, because obviously we're working in a permanent form of art, and also it can just delay everything. Right off the rip, when I bring a design or I'm working on something, I'm asking the person their thoughts about it. Because if it's in the wrong direction, I want to change that as quick as possible. Even once we have the design and I'm placing the stencil, I'll give the client a light walkthrough as to what I plan on accomplishing that day. Maybe the style I'm going to do the shading, just to help build proper expectation for them. This was not something I always did and it would only lead to problems or someone feeling bad or not getting exactly what they wanted. 
Through doing this, you end up building trust with your client, which is the whole thing. Trust is everything. When you have trust with the client, you get the freedom in the artwork. They're not worried about what you're gonna put on their skin. You've already communicated everything. It's just a better experience for everyone. The client can rest. They found their artist cool. You know, this guy or girl gets me and just run with it.